been a long time. How have you been? I think we can put our differences behind us. For science, you monster. Portal 2. Wow, what can be said about this game? Probably one of the best strategy games I've ever played in my life. And just generally like one of the best games ever. Honestly, it's... I don't even know. It, one of the best games ever that, that's that's the only way you could put it uh so yeah the reason why i'm not playing the first one is because like the first one's good but no we don't have to say that again um the first one is good but it's uh the second one's way better so if you haven't seen the first one i suggest you go see that or see that not seeing that uh, so, you know, you know the plot and everything, or at least just go see, like, the, f like, few final episodes of whoever you're watching. So, this is gonna be a walkthrough, or not walkthrough, but, uh, a playthrough of Portal 2. If you're wondering why, it's because, uh... Uh, it's because it just came out with backwards compatibility. Uh, so yeah, I just want to play it again. So yeah, let's get right into it. Wait, actually, I just want to see if I, if they, if I actually... Nah, okay, never mind. Alrighty, so let's get right into it. Yes, I, I know about autosave, thank you. So yeah, during cutscenes and stuff, I won't talk because, you know, I don't want you guys to see. And it's not, and this shouldn't be like a one hour video as my past ones have been. So that w I just did that because Halo Wars 2 is a beta and stuff, so I wanted to get as much stuff as I possibly can. So yeah. Good morning. You have been Hello. in suspension for 50 days. In compliance. State and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Down. Okay, fine. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down. This game's a little Good. glitchy. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness it. exercise. Framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. Mm, interesting. Low you raise. should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, nope. reflect briefly on this classical music. The hell? The buzz was very annoying. Now, please return to your bed. Oh my god. Wow. Good morning. You have been in suspension for... Nine, 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 nine. Hello? Anyone in there? Subject should vacate the enrichment Hello? Immediately. Any Hi. Are you gonna open the door? Time. Sure. Any time? To have exercised his or her right. Ah! Ah! Oh, God. Hi. Oh, wow. You look, te um, good. Looking good, actually. Are you okay? How are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm, stay, stay calm, prepare. <laughs> it's all I'm saying, prepare. It's all fine, all right? Don't move, I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might wanna hang on to something. Word of advice, up to you. That chair just broke around. You all right down there? Can you hear me? What's on TV? Hello? Oh. 
most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. That's not minor. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Oh God. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? It's close. Can you see? Make it through. I've got enough space. That's not... Uh, just, just got to get through here. Okay, I just got to concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, no and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, all right? Not dead. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Yeah, down. Down. Oh, that was genius. Good news, that is not a docking station. One mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. <laughs> Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Docking station 500. Almost there. Below. Remember, Not you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Oh, God, wow, that actually pushed me forward. Wow, I'm still alive. There we go. Now, I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But, um, at least you're a good jumper. So, you got that. You got the jumping on your side. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. Okay. Seems legit. All right. Off you go. Good luck! Hello. And again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. Where did I jump from? We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance. Oops. Our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. Oh. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. Wow. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three... Two, one. Ooh, <laughs> I like that. You can see yourself. Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube and button-based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Twice. You have just passed through an Aperture Science Material Emancipation Drill, which vaporizes most Aperture Science equipment that touches it. Cool. So I haven't played this game in ever, but I think I still have the general knowledge down. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Ah. Uh. Oh, there it is. Let's go put 
this on there. There we go. Hello. Cameras. Good. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, a lot your of test environment is unsupervised. Okay. Before re-entering a relaxation right. vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Right. So. Doing pretty good right now. Don't worry. This game gets way more interesting. It's just, you know. If the Earth is easier. currently governed by a manner of Animal King, Sentient Cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to it. Some giant turn. I think that's actually an Easter egg somewhere on the map. I actually go to it all the time. I forget hey, where it is. Hey, you made hey. it! Hi. There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. I can't see it though. It's not here. Maybe it fell off. Oh, oh yeah, it happens. <laughs> Can you see the portal gun? I don't know. Also, I should forget where it is. Lie. Oh, there it is. What's the point of coming up? Go team! I, I always found this interesting. We have highly technological portal guns, but we still have these types of computers that use floppy disks. Like, what? <laughs> Why? We can make portal guns, but we can't make decent computers? Alright. Seems legit. Which way do I go? Some emergency testing oh. may require prolonged with lethal military androids. Oops. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. <laughs> one copy to share. <laughs> Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. So yeah, there's just a bunch of little like jokes and stuff hidden in the audio. It's pretty funny. And once again, don't worry, this game does get more interesting. It does get, yep, my friend. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed what? in three, two, one. Excuse me? The frick do you mean, lost connection? Hold on, technical difficulties. There we go. There we go. We're, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine. Pew. Whoopsie, was me, was me. I do it. Cat. Oh, I want to take that TV. The enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space. 
Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Why do they only, like, think of space? What about other stuff? Like zombies. Hello, Mr. Cube. Uh, what's this? Okay, so this is where the tests really start. Alright. And fall off the edge. Yep. Okay. Good enough. Well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances oh, may appear away from the door, you are not alone. All aperture science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic low power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. 1 .1 volts is not much. I heard cracking. What the hell was that? This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. If physics no longer work, what? Okay. <laughs> oh, I missed it. Are you kidding me? Momentum. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this was amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future, and the future starts with you. I hate cameras. Uh. Huh. Cat. Ow, my face. Okay. That was horrible. Oh yeah. Aha, I'm a genius. There we go. Now we put the portal a little higher. And then fail that, because I'm a genius. Yeah. Good work getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for- Tribe? Racist. Where's Wheatley? I want to see him again. Wheatley's that little, like, uh, white, white ball. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment what? Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Hey! Oi, oi! Oh, I'm there up is. there! Oh, brilliant! You did find a portal gun! Oh, the... Do you know what? It just goes to show, people with brain damage, the real heroes, in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? Brave. Pop a portal on that wall behind me there, and I'll meet you on the other side of the room. Okay, listen, let me... Let something on you here, it's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail, or I would die. But we're out of options here, so get ready to catch me, all right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? One. 
two, three. That's high. It's it's too high, isn't it? Really, that. All right, going on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Catch me! Catch me! Catch me! Ow! Ow! I am not dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you Where? something. You'll be impressed by this. Oh, Wheatley's getting enabled. Um... Can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not, I'm not joking. Can you just turn around for a second? All right, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. That I open while your back was turned. Paper hand off we go. Look at this! No rail to tell us where to go! Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. <laughs> Hold on, though. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, just follow the rail, actually. Oh, oh turn. no. Yes, hello. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. No, thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving. Keep moving. Loading screen. Call it. Even though there is a lot of loading screens, this game's still amazing. And it's on Xbox One, so it loads way faster. I probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, Let's we're going to have to go through her chain. And she will probably kill us if, if she's um, awake. So yeah, this is why I told you guys to go watch a Portal 1 playthrough. Because... There's a bunch of Okay, I'm gonna leave my cards yeah. on the table. I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a maniac. Do you know who ended up uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not gonna believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um Absolutely nothing happened. And then there's us escaping now, so um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch me. Jump! It's actually, look at that. That is quite a, that's quite a distance, isn't it? Ah! Oh, still held. Still being held. You did, that's a great job. You've applied the grit. We're all fine. Tremendous. The little thing about him saying that a human escaped. Spoiler alert. Skip ahead about five seconds if you don't want to hear this. So yeah, spoiler alert. It was you. That's what you did in Portal 1. Ah! I just, sorry, I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I've just done it again. <laughs> I don't know why, but I find British people so funny. This is the wow. main breaker room. Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Not anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't, don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something that doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing, all right? But don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. Let there be light. That's uh, God. It's quoting God. Oh, look at that. Turning. Ominous. Probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Now, escape pod, escape pod. This is moving up. Okay, okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. This should slow it down. No, makes it go faster. Uh-oh. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. All right, stop panicking. Uh, I, can, I can still Hi. stop this. Um, uh, oh, there's a, there's a pass. Okay, it's fine, I'll just, I'll just, not a problem. A, 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 um, A, 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 Wait, did I do B? Do you have a pen? Start writing these down. Power up, complete. I don't, okay, 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 listen. All right, new plan. Act natural, act natural, we've done nothing. Hello? Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy. Dead. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Oh, oh no! No, 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 no! Oh, no, 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 no! Ah. Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. But I think we can put our differences behind us. For science, you monster. 
I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it, too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. So, yeah. I guess that wasn't really a spoiler alert since she told you. So, yeah, anyone who actually skipped. Here we are, the incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere once you find it. Uh, save. We can start testing, so, just like all time. Turret, save you. And save him. And save him. There it is. Hold on. There. Good. You have a dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Yeah, now it's one. Once That's testing starts, cool. I'm required by protocol to keep interacting with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you've that done fun. that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm happy to put this robot. all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do it. More or less. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. But the important thing is you are back. With me. And now I'm on to all yeah. the little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing. For the rest of yeah. your life. After that, who yeah. knows? I pick up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. Zombies. And that's how Black Ops 1 zombies were made. Just kidding. Ah, uh, so this is chapter two. So I'm gonna have to end the uh, that, that I'm gonna have to end it. Oh my god! I'm gonna have to end the episode here if I could English, because I do not English good and I don't words good. So yeah, lazy. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for the sarcasm self test complete. Oh good, that's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test which involves deadly lasers, and how test subjects ah. react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Ah. So yeah, lasers! Yeah, those are fun. But yeah, I'm gonna have to end the episode here, uh, so tune back tomorrow, and yeah, for more some for some more Portal 2, and maybe other stuff. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode.